Remember that awesome game called Rocket League? It was all about cars and soccer. Well, you literally play like soccer with cars. It was super popular. But lately, it kind of just died. I mean, like, I haven't seen a single thing. I haven't heard anyone talk about it. It's like the party's over and there's only a few stragglers left. So what really caused Rocket League to lose its spark? Well, there's a few reasons. First off, the game just isn't getting any updates. Not getting at least any cool updates. It gives updates, but it's all just new cars, new collaborations. There's nothing new. There's no like new game modes. There's no new cool feature. Like imagine playing with the same toys over and over again. It gets kind of boring, right? Rocket League used to be my go-to game, but now it's just the same old thing. Where's the excitement? I feel ya. It's like they forgot about us players. We want new stuff to keep things fresh. But it's not just the lack of updates that's the problem. There's like a ton of other games out there that are also seeking for attention. You got games like Fortnite, Minecraft, that these games are constantly evolving, adding new features and keeping players engaged. Rocket League isn't doing anything, it's just there. People, if you really like the game, people hop on, but most of the people who play it kind of stopped. With so many options out there, they're looking for the next big thing. And if Rocket League can't keep up, they'll move on to something else. It's like being at a buffet with so many delicious options. Like if the mac and cheese doesn't taste good, you get the pizza. But if you're tired of the pizza, you get... A sandwich or something but it's not all doom and gloom there's still hope for rocket league the support of epic games there's a chance of comeback oh well did i mention that epic games kind of forgot about rocket league that's kind of why this is a big issue they literally removed a entire community they destroyed a community there were multiple discord servers there were literal apps that people were getting just so they could trade with other players to get cool cosmetics for their car when they're hitting a ball around a virtual soccer field. Here's the thing though, Epic Games has the resources, they have have the experience to make games good. Like Fortnite, Fortnite is literally thriving right now. It was dead, but now it's back to life, like even I'm playing it, even though I quit like maybe a year ago. And now I'm back to it and it, I love it. So hopefully they can add new content instead of just adding collaborations. And maybe they'll reignite the flame Rocket League once had. And let's not forget about the power of the community. Players are literally the heart and soul of any game. And their feedback and ideas can also shape the future of the game. From tournaments to fan arts like there are still people who play rocket league just not the way you used to trying new things out hosting custom tournaments that have nothing to do with the actual thing that rocket league was made for by listening to the people's voices i think epic games can really make the game like a lot better so in the end while rocket league may have hit a rough patch there's still hope on the horizon with just some effort, like literally, they need a crew of maybe less than 20 people working on the game. And they can get it back to the glory days of how Rocket League was once, in, like for me, the best game out there. I used to play it all the time. Rocket League could be back in the game better than ever, but they just need to work on it. Anyways, that's it for this video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. We're not putting more and more, so you don't want to miss any of the new videos coming out. There's some exciting things planned out for obviously not Rocket League, because even I'm bored of it, and I even I don't want to play it. But you know, Fortnite new season, fun. So hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification button. All right, at this point, I'm just begging. I'll see you next time.